come out here uh, the other night when it was starting to snow pretty good and get pictures of these guys with snow covering them. Uh, but to be honest with you, it was cold and snowing and dark and, you know, I don't think it started snowing here until around 11 o'clock. Uh, so, I just didn't do it. <laughs> um, but, I know from past experience that when I post pictures of these guys with ice all over them or snow all over them, um, I get a lot of hate mail. <laughs> uh, you know, most of it's from well-meaning, but uninformed people uh, demanding to know why I don't have a barn for these guys. <laughs> uh, you know, I've gotten emails asking why I'm cruel. You know, why can't I just put them inside till it warms up or, you know, at least till it quits snowing or icing or whatever. Um, if you're one of those people, <laughs> um, you know, y'all do me a favor and take some time to realize what kind of animals these are. Uh, this long hair is there for a reason. Uh, it's to protect these guys from snow and ice and things like that. Uh, you know, most of the time when it's bad weather, uh, these guys just soon stay out in it. Um, you know, I can't hardly ever get them to go inside when the weather is bad. Uh, about the only time they spend much time in the barn at all um, is when it's hot outside. You know, in the middle of summer when it's 80 or 90 degrees out here, um, then yeah, they'll spend a lot of time in the barn because, you know, I've got this giant fan in there, you know, that blows on them and, you know, helps keep them cooled off. Uh, a lot of times you'll see them down there in the swampy area, uh, soaking their legs. Um, you know, we always, if you look back at some of the other videos or Whatever, you'll see people commenting about Hamish's socks or, you know, Kylo's socks or whatever. Uh, it's basically just mud that comes up to their knees. Um, you know, but he really is about the only thing they, they try and get away from. Uh, you know, if it's snow or ice, you know, they just soon stand out in it. That's what they're, that's what they're built for. You know, their, their coat here is a two-part thing. Uh, this long guard hair uh, helps shed the ice and snow and rain and things like that. But underneath here, uh, there's some really soft down hair. Um, and that keeps them well insulated. Um, you know, other breeds of cattle have this thick fat layer um, underneath their skin. Uh, and that's why you see a lot of, a lot of the beef uh, out there with, you know, a lot of fat in it. Um, whereas island beef is, is very lean compared to other uh, breeds. Uh, you know, and most of that is due to this long coat. Uh, you know, with with a double coat of hair, uh, they don't need that fat layer to keep them warm. So, works out for them. Uh, I think we're finally starting to get our issues with Facebook under control. Um, they've made a few modifications and changes that seem to have helped quite a bit. Uh, we're going to try and do our first live video uh, here in the next few days, um, and we'll see how that goes. Uh, but 
otherwise, you know, it's, it's, they changed a bunch of stuff, so that's, that's going to take a little getting used to, but at least, um, at least the stuff they changed works now. <laughs> so, of course, the way Facebook is going, I'm not sure how much longer any of that is going to work out either. Uh, you know, I'm not a real big fan of censorship. Uh, you know, I may not agree with somebody, but you know, I certainly don't wish to take away their right to say it. Uh, you know, even if I think they're stupid, you know, it's their right to be stupid. <laughs> you know, I'm, I'm sure they look at me sometimes and think I'm an idiot for some of the stuff that I believe. And that's fine, you know, that's differences is what makes us, you know, individuals. Uh, but when you get people in, you know, especially corporations that start saying, well, you can't say this, you can't say that. Uh, you know, that's, that's when I kind of have an issue with it. And I understand that Facebook is a privately held company. Uh, but there are still rules, regulations, laws, etc. Uh, concerning you know, censorship within private companies. Uh, you know, if they're, you know, if it's a news organization or if it's, you know, just a, business um, so but I'm gonna let smarter people than me worry about all that you know I'm gonna kind of go with it as best I can until I get fed up yeah yeah I know keep brushing daddy keep brushing <laughs>